Okay. Are we live? I think we are. Okay, let's What is going on guys? I'm just gonna share the link of the stream so we can get uh, more people join us because um, today I wanna talk about something very important. It's basically, we need to find a way to count the armaments because uh, what I'm doing um, what I do in Live Arena basically open up with Armands is a start first, but if I go second and my enemy get Armands, it's pretty much GG. Especially if I have to ban uh, you make a Warlord instead of Armands. I try to ban Armands all the time, but um, I always prioritize the uh, local champion because either way, Armands or the local champion, I'm, um, I'm dead, but at least with... Uh, with Armands, I can maybe have a chance if I don't get the stuns uh, or maybe I'm lucky with some ships. So, yeah, and especially because we got the free removal gear, I need to make sure that uh, I'm gonna build my champions today for free. So, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna jump into my uh, roster. And actually, let me get the chat first. Where's the chat? Lost the chat. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna put the chat here. Just minimize the chat uh, so I'm not gonna miss any messages. I go. So, what I was thinking, uh, where's Armands? Armands. It's right here. So I got him like that. This is my build and uh, he's been helping me a ton in live arena. When I pick him, the chance that I have to win are very, very high because if they ban him, I can play with my other four champions and I use the, and I usually draft the other four champions to counter the enemy team. But if they don't ban him, I can use him and I can go first. Uh, or maybe second, you know, I can cut in and drop the Dormita, strip them, ship them, or whatever. My total sets now are these ones. Uh, I got him uh, fast for the stone skin build, is kind of fast. And then um, this is the only accuracy that I have at the moment, but I'm missing the one from the uh, Blessing. And I'm also missing the Mastery. I haven't done the Mastery yet. So once I get, actually gonna get these ones for now. At least those ones. Oh no, we can't get this. Okay, once I'm gonna get all the way down, I should get 50 plus 75, that's 125. And then I have to also, um, no, I think I already glyph him. So I can be almost at uh, 650. Okay, 650, that's pretty good for the Armand's build. Uh, one second, let me move this one away. So now, how can we counter him? Because um, the thing is, uh, he's gonna go fast, and usually everybody open up with this skill, so they use this skill to drop the Tormitor of your champions and to place the stuns. Now, if you have stone skin, you can't get the decrease uh, of your Tormitor. And if, for example, you manage to go first with uh, for a champion like Sifi, you can still get the Tormitor down, but you're not going to get the stun. So this is a way to counter Harmans is to go first with um, Sifi and protect your team from the stuns. But you're going to get the Tormitor down and then it's going to go again because it's going to gain so much Tormitor and it's going to ship one of your champion. 
and usually they target the DPS because this skill um, avoid uh, UDK. UDK can't protect you from this. So if, for example, one of your uh, DPS get banned, they're gonna target your only DPS and you pretty much lose the fight. So um, it's very, very hard. So what I've been thinking now, I've been thinking to build some DPS just for uh, Armands to counter him. And I'm gonna build those DPS in uh, stone skin, okay? Because I need to make sure that I don't get the terminated depletion and I don't get the stuns. Um, and maybe those DPS that I wanna build, they're gonna be in, um, actually no, if they're gonna be force affinity, it doesn't matter because this skill can't wick it. It doesn't attack you, it just plays it on you. But they can wick it with this one. So it doesn't really matter if you have um, stone skin or not for this one. But I'm thinking probably the best counter for uh, Armands will be uh, this champion here, Kandrafon, because um, Kandrafon is gonna get the veil. So when Armands gonna use the A2, he's gonna get the veil with his passive. And that means uh, because he has the veil, he can't be targeted. So if you build him in stone skin, he can be probably the best counter to Armas. But I don't know if I got accessory, stone skin accessories. No, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I don't have it because uh, I'm desperately in need of demon spawn accessory, uh, stone skin accessory, because I have like, you know, Duchess, Kaimar, Helica, so many champions are from the Debo spots. We use them in uh, Live Arena. So, what I should do, I think I need to build him from scratch, and I probably can because I don't have him in um, Savage anyway. So, let's see if I got a good uh, stone skin set around. My tool is stone skin. I can probably give him my tool vault uh, set, but I like to keep tool vault stone skin if I can. Hmm, I don't know. Let's see. So let's start with the critical damage gloves. It's stone skin. I don't. I'll go. Okay, I got this one, and it's not bad. Even this one here, but I think the first one is better because I have um, speed and attack percent. So I'm gonna try this one. Let's see if I got a chest attack chest. Okay, attack chest, I got uh, this one here actually. Okay, I'm not using the champion anyway. So, let me try. But the thing is, we're not, we gotta be fast, otherwise, if you're not fast, we're pretty much dead anyway. So let's see, these uh, boots, uh, they give me 32 speed, but I lose a lot of critical rate. Uh, what do I have here? Mm, I got the same issue basically. So I'm gonna put them on just to see. I need to get uh, critical rate from the substats. I have to absolutely. Otherwise, I can't move. I need to be at least at 250 in order to have a chance to get encounter with him. Um, so I need to one more piece because I think one one turn stone skin is enough. All you gotta do is survive one turn and then you can try and counter back. So this one gave me a bit of speed. Let's see. Mm. Maybe I can give him this one. Okay, and now I need to get uh, critical rate. So I need a lot of critical rate. So I'm gonna come here and do uh, highest critical rate. And then I'm gonna select these pieces here. Let's see if I got uh, uh, any sets is fine. Maybe I can go with uh, Cruel maybe. 
Let's see if I got a crew build. I think I got a PCR. Yeah, this one has a lot of critical rate, so it might be handy. Okay, and now I need to get the weapon. So the highest is this one. I'm still gonna be short anyway, I'm still gonna be really really low. So I'm missing 10% critical rate and I'm not even at 7000 attack. And I got very low damage too. Okay, let's swap it. Let's see if I can do the opposite. So I'm gonna get some better weapons here. Because maybe I got some uh, mythical piece. Otherwise, I need to use this one from Turvolt. But I need Turvolt to counter Arima. That's why I don't want to get these pieces from Turvolt. Um, hey, Boga. Thanks, mate. How you doing? I know I haven't done... Um, alive since uh, I think it was the end of November early December basically when I got Quintus I stopped doing lives because I haven't done live arena since I got burned out pretty much plus I got busy I move out uh, and um, yeah I didn't have the chance basically how you been anyway Okay, so I don't think I can do this build with Candlefog, but anyway, I'm gonna keep it for later. I know I can build this champion, his stone skin, and little, so I'm gonna start with him. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select these two, um, these two accessories that I got. Actually, they're not equipped. Pretty sure they're here somewhere. So one is this one. So this is a stone skin um, critical damage. Um, amulet so i'm gonna put them on and then i got a banner here that is gonna be defense so i'm gonna lose the accuracy banner that i have right now and i'm gonna give you this piece that is a five star piece but it's still like god tier piece because you roll like perfect it's literally triple roll here double roll on the defense so i'm gonna give him this piece and i'm gonna select them actually and then I'm gonna change, uh, um, I'm gonna still keep him little, but I'm gonna change two pieces. So I need to uh, break, um, I'm supposed to break this um, gauntlet and this, uh, sorry, this helmet. So I'm gonna lose a lot of speed, I'm pretty sure about this. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, actually what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna give him the set that I got on Gofred. Goffrey is a champion that um, I build um, in little, but his damage is so low that he doesn't deserve the little set. So that's the champion I'm talking about, Goffred. I'm doing good. Did you pull any mythical these two times? No, man. I open only, I think, five shards. Uh, but I open about 35 uh, in the recent weeks. And with 35 shards, I didn't got anything. I think I'm about 80 shards since I opened all my primal shards and I haven't got any. I only got one legendary champion, that's it. Uh, but I am thinking of buying some um, some packs. I think tomorrow I'm going to do it. So hopefully I can get lucky. Maybe I can open like 30 to 40 shards and see what happens. Because... Um, I'm not saying that I'm close to Mercy, but maybe I got a high chance if I open another 40, hopefully. So let's see, maybe it's gonna be my um, Easter gift. Hey buddy, how's it going mate? Welcome to the live. We are trying to build some champion for um, countering Armands in Live Arena. So what do I need here? I need this... Um, now this one I think I'm gonna keep it to defense. I'm gonna give him this. That is not the best. I only go like defense roll here. So I'm gonna give him this. And I'm gonna basically find the last piece. There should be stone skin, right? Yeah, we need stone skin. So where are the stone skin pieces at the bottom? 
Okay, stone skin from Goffred. There should be a weapon somewhere here. Here he is. So that's the one. And then uh, we're gonna find a shield. Where's the shield? I think the shield has gotta be one of those ones. Oh, oh wait, there is a shield from Goffred. Ah yes, there is this one here, I think. Yeah, okay, this one here that has a lot of speed. This is actually a 29 speed piece and I'm gonna do this and I think this is gonna be the build so I'm gonna lose some HP but it's fine I'm gonna gain more defense uh, speed I'm kind of lowish um, let me see if I can fix the speed because I, I would like to be faster than that and then we got 100% uh, critical rate 254 but I need to take the um, amulet to 16 so I'm gonna do that as well let me see if I got another chest let's see so chest, chest, chest because which one is this one so this one is this one here mm, okay so do I have a chest with better defense stats so I got this one, but I'm gonna lose uh, too much critical rate. This one is not the one. I don't, I don't think I got it. Another one, unfortunately. Okay, no, I don't think I got any better. Or maybe this one. No, I'm gonna get just gain a critical rate. Okay, do you guys are you guys using Armands in Lava Arena? It's pretty broken if I have to be honest. It's actually give me a lot of um, win rate just because he became my local champion basically. People are banning him all the time, and I can win my with my two DPS and my two other support champions. But then when I found him against me. It's pretty much GG. I pretty much lose straight away. So, uh, I would like to be faster than this, but um, I think I'm missing something. Let's see if I can find a better piece uh, somewhere here. Okay, this one gave me a bit more speed, but I lose damage. You know what? I'm just gonna, um, I just gonna select this build, or maybe let me check if I took a screenshot of the build that I made um, a, like a few weeks ago. Status. Let's see. Now I think it's this one. So I'm gonna select this build right here. Right. So let me remove this. Select this one. Oh my god, on a space. Okay, so what we're gonna do. I think uh, I'm, I'm gonna have space if I just swap. Uh, okay, perfect. Okay, and now I'm gonna look for those um, boots that I have on him. Here we go. And I'm also gonna. Um, take those pieces. I'm not sure if I can do them all to be honest. Okay, now I can only do one piece. Okay, I'm gonna see if, if I'm gonna do this one or because I'm planning on building all the champions, I might need to do um, use those um, dust for all the builds. So I'm gonna try and put a glyph here. Of course, it's gonna be a one. <laughs> okay, four. Yeah, he's. Uh, tier for uh, free to play the pick and ban phase gives an advantage if you pick him yes you need to go first it's um it happens sometimes that i go second and the enemy picks uh, like you know see or something but most of the time they just pick him so by building him in stone skin i hope i can basically first of all i don't want to get the um termiter down because otherwise i'm not gonna get a turn so i'm gonna do this and then i'm gonna take him to level um 16. okay done and also gonna put a big leaf here 
and um, I don't know, Stonski is gonna be at least for the turn meter is gonna be massive, but then they can still um, ship uh, my status, right? So that's why I need to build two nuker with this set, the stone skin set. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like that. Uh, let me drop some accuracy as well. It's nice to have accuracy on him and more HP, so maybe I'm not gonna die. Okay, this is the, the final build. I don't think I can glyph anything else. Let's see. Oh, yes, I can glyph. Oh, I can glyph those pieces. So I have two pieces with uh, missing speed. So I'm gonna do this. Unfortunately, I finished the six pieces. I mean, the six star glyphed, unfortunately. Hopefully, I can get another four. Of course, <laughs> I got a, I got a one. Another one. My god, this is so bad. Of course, it too. I'm gonna leave it like that. It's not worth it to try and get more speed. So this is the total stats: um, fifty-one thousand HP, six point three thousand defense, two hundred thirty-two speed, hundred uh, critical rate, and two hundred seventy-eight critical damage. I hopefully I can get the uh, four star blessing, but I'm missing this, this the defense, so I'm missing the three star and the four star. So once I'm gonna do those two star, it's gonna be huge. So hopefully I can get them soon. So this is gonna be one of the champions. Now, another champion that I built already is uh, Lady Mikage, guys. Lady Mikage has been helping me a lot against Armas because um, I got him in stone skin as well, as you can see. And um, I might be faster than uh, uh, than Armas. So if I'm faster, I can go with that and I can do all attack on him or I can maybe stun him, or I can strip him and do something at least, you know. But I think I need to build there fast. And to do that, I need to change some pieces, right? So what I can do is... Um, so first of all, what I'm going to do, let me check this. So this is speed with speed. Let me do this. Let me change Armands. What is it? Why am I looking like that? So Armands, this uh, changing gears, guys, is insane. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this piece of Armands and I'm going to give you another one that is very similar. That it's uh, somewhere here. This used to be um, on uh, Yukon, but now I got Yukon in um, Merciless. So I don't need this on Yukon anymore. So if I do this, Okay, I'm gonna put this one on right. I need to get another. Um, so I'm gonna change this piece. I'm gonna change the probably the chest plate. I need to find a chest plate with um, with accuracy, right? So accuracy. Let's see if I got something equipped with a lot of. Uh, hmm, I think I need to give him this one. Let me think, uh, is it going to be this one? Yeah, because if I want to build uh, Lady Mikage faster, I need to change the boots. But uh, like this, I'm going to miss some, I'm going to lose some speed. Uh, okay, I think it's fine. Let's, let's try to do this. I'm going to take it to uh, 16. And then as soon as I finish with this build, I'm gonna jump into Lava Arena that is on now and I'm gonna test this stuff straight away. So stay with me for a few more um, minutes. So let me try and get the Ascension to be accuracy. Okay, HP percentage, not bad. Okay, so I lost full speed, but I'm gonna do this. Okay, and now I'm gonna go back on Lady Mikage. And I'm gonna give her that um, uh, the chest plate that I have uh, on. Uh, was it this one? Yeah, this one here. So if I give him this one, and I'm gonna basically um, get the the weapon that I got on my Duchess that is very very fast. 
so I can build the faster something like this so 363 so yeah I got two pieces of perception four pieces of stone skin okay 363 is where I want to be okay perfect and now what I'm gonna do I want to build also another champion is stone skin and this is gonna be um, Arbiter because basically what happened when my enemy pick uh, Armands I basically put Sifi and Lady Mikage on my first two option and then as my third option I'm gonna put Arbiter and a Nuker and then I'm gonna finish with another Nuker so in this way I'm gonna have Lady Mikage, Sifi and Arbiter on my team and I should go before Armands and I can try and kill Armands that's, the, that's my goal I don't know if it's gonna be if it's gonna be like that but um, we will see so now I'm gonna give him the boots that I got on Armands on him just uh, just for now because this is actually good on a uh, accuracy champion and now I'm gonna get uh, some stone skin pieces here I think I got this one or this one okay this one I'm gonna take it to level 12 Okay, we got this bunch of uh, stats, but we don't really care. I just have to make it in a one turn stone skin. So if I don't go first, I'm gonna be able to survive. I don't think I got a better piece here. So I'm gonna roll this one. Let's see what it rolls. Hopefully roll attack. Okay, it did roll attack. Mm, but it also roll um, very bad defense flat double roll very very unlucky so i'm gonna do this so i got three pieces now i need one more piece and uh, i'm gonna look for it in the i think i got a red piece here so i'm gonna look for the highest speed possible so highest speed possible and stone skin where stone skin is here at the bottom okay so do I have, uh, I think I got him on Arbiter as well, I literally am going to strip my Arbiter today, I think. So, my god, many pieces. Go down, go down. I should have just do this. Okay, let's see. Okay, we also gain speed, so that's pretty good. So, we got 368. And we're going to select this. Now, before I, I'm gonna jump in arena right now, but before I do that, I need to just build the Duchess again, not this one. Uh, should be this one here, because I lost those two pieces, this, just in case I need to use Duchess, you know. So we're gonna do this, and we're just gonna be, put the pieces with the highest speed possible, just for now. Maybe not this one, maybe this one, 18. And uh, yeah, this one here is it the same? 17. Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna go with yeah, this one here. Okay, so we lost pretty much 300 uh, 30 speed, but it's still a pretty good build. Plus, I can drop some glyph uh, in another day. Okay, so we got there, and the last champion need to rebuild because I might need him is Goffred. I use Goffred when I'm facing um team with Georgit, so I need to build it before I jump into Lavarina. I think I'm gonna build him in Stone Skin, and that's it. So I'm gonna do a two turn Stone Skin. Let's see what we can get, and I'm gonna also give him a Curacy because I wanna try and um, place the you know the stuns. Uh, okay, so maybe I'm not gonna make him super slow. Let's see. Do I have a piece with, with speed here? Speed and stone skin. I don't have anything with accuracy, so I'm just gonna go with. Uh, my god, these pieces are horrible. <laughs> they are so so bad. Um, actually, I got the uh, still the um, two pieces, so I need to. I can go with two pieces here. So I'm not gonna give him any of those. So I'm gonna try and get defense, I guess, and probably HP as well. 
because I don't want to be too low in case I use a uh, neck right so I'm gonna go with uh, maybe this one and uh, let's see do I have HP here or not so maybe I'm gonna just give him this one for now I don't have any speed here or maybe this one okay let's go with this one and then um, actually I just think maybe I need accuracy on the chest plate so accuracy what do we have we have this one and this one okay they both crab so don't worry about that so we got four turn now I'm gonna look for substat speed and accuracy I guess and I'm gonna look for those pieces here at the, at the top and then we're gonna finish this build and jump into Lava Arena we're gonna test if we can counter Armands with these three new champions that are building stone skin so we're gonna use this one and let's see an helmet gonna give him why not I'm gonna give him this one speed okay so that's done and now last pieces are gonna be uh, maybe perception so I can maybe land um, some uh, debuff it's not even booked mine I never booked my gofred what the hell is going on here no okay let's see so perception where is it here I got this piece is good enough okay and now I need a uh, defense so we can see the um, the shields and um, but I don't want to be too fast you know what? I'm just gonna go with this one okay so that's it hopefully it's gonna be a decent build yeah, because I still want to get a turn and try to stun them or place the increased defense. I mean, the increase, uh, yeah, increased defense on my champion, but it's not fully book. Uh, it still works without books because his pass, he doesn't need any books. But eventually, one day, I'm going to try and book him. Okay, guys, so like I said, we got um, hair in stone skin now. One turn stone skin, we got. Um, Dutch is still in stone skin, but it's a bit slower. And then we have uh, Staltus in stone skin. And uh, we're gonna use Arbiter in stone skin as well. I managed to get uh, like 368, I think. See, 268 in one turn stone skin. And that's it. This is gonna be the way I'm gonna counter Armands. Let's jump into. Um, live arena i'm currently at 4123 points and uh, let's see so if i if i go first i'm gonna pick him <laughs> okay so I'm, I'm not gonna pick him if i go second obviously so what i'll do where is it so i know tech champion okay this one is the one that i use for live arena here it is so only if I go second, I'm gonna like try to counter him. Obviously, I still wanna win those fights. I hate to be against Arman. So, all right. So he pick uh, Sifi and Narcis. Well, um, so when I go against Narcis, I'm not sure if I can ban him. I need to make sure I don't bring any champion in boosters. Otherwise, it's GG, right? So uh champion with poster obviously i can't use necret so we can use probably duchess but you know what i'm gonna get ancora because um i want to get ancora off him and then i'm gonna probably use uh, helicat here and uh let me get duchess as well actually no, i'm gonna get a nuker i'm gonna get him as a nuker I'm back with Yukong Nuking. I've been missing him for so long. But now that I have Armands, I don't need him to be a um, CC anymore. Alright, he countered me very hard with Arima though. So, so, 1, 2, and 3. And he got another support here. 
Hmm. So I think I'm gonna go with Helicat and um, I need to use another Nuker. He only has one Reviver, so I might go with um, I might go with Turvold, I think. Yeah, I think Turbo is my best option. Because I just want to get rid of Sifi and then kill Arima. Hopefully go with uh, no, another revive. If he pick a revive, I don't know if I can win this. Because I'm pretty sure he's going to ban my Yukon. Or oh, Helicat. Constanty to block revive him. Yeah, but my Constanty is not super built. Um... Wait, you're talking about Constantine to block revival um, Narses or Arima? Oh damn, he went with Duchess. Okay, so... Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna ban Arima because otherwise my Yugo can't do damage. But if he bans my Helicat, I don't know if I can win. Oh, right, I got Arman, so he has to bend the Armands, right. Okay, beautiful. That's why I love Armands. I forgot about it. So we might have a small chance if we go... Um, actually, no, we, we are all in Stone Skin, right? Yeah, we got everybody in Stone Skin, so we got a chance, yeah. Um, I mean, Yugo is going to die, but he's going to revive himself, so it's all good. Yeah, it's all Gucci for now. And once I'm gonna put the... Oh well, you can see strip me. Okay, didn't use the strip because... Um, this is the skill that plays the weekend. So it's gonna strip me next... Wait, no, this is the skill that strip you. Okay, it failed. So it should have it should have used it there. It should have waited. It should have used the skill now when I got the block damage. Yeah, block revive, demo revive, undead faction. Ah, okay, beautiful. Yeah, I didn't talk about it actually. I got Narses as well. So am I am I building? Because I got him in stone skin, but it's very, very slow. So I can't do much with him right now. So let's see here. I don't see any um what's it called? Any ship like polymorph. So I can use this skill without problem. And my Yuko now doesn't have any accuracy. Uh, because uh, I don't want to get uh, the ship, so I just want to do damage basically. I'm just waiting for the Duchess to get rid of the stun skin, and then I'm gonna use the um, the two. But now I'm thinking the Sif is gonna sleep my champion, or maybe not. Actually, because I got her, Sif can't sleep uh, my Yukong. Okay, just gonna do a one for now. I want to keep the the cleanser in case I get the sleep or something. Or the stuns, because it's going to stun me now. Okay, beautiful. I think he got weak hit. Uh, yeah, I don't think he can sleep me. Can't do, I'm, I'm not going to use... Um, I'm not going to do the increased attack. I, no, I don't want to lose the... I don't want to lose the block damage. I'm just going to do it like that. It's fine because I just want to get him low so I can do a big splash damage. See now basically I'm going to protect um, UDK. Uh, sorry, Yukon. Okay, we got my... He, got, he increased my cooldowns. Are they going to be dead if I attack with this skill? Actually, let's use this one now. And then I'm going to use the AOE next turn. Uh, what he can do, he can use the one and sleep one of my champions. Okay, did that. It's gonna buff. Hopefully, I still got day two available on Yukon. Okay, she's dead. Beautiful. No, I don't have her. And um, just gonna do a one. Okay, now I lost uh, my block damage. And I'm in big, big trouble. <laughs> Narsa is a one, the one that um, increase your cooldown. 
is on a 50-50 chance. So hit the 50% chance, unfortunately. Okay, they're all dead except for him. Now I'm dead because now I can't kill. I can't even hit the, the Sifu basically. I can just do this. Alright, GG. I lost this one. Unlucky. Yeah, Yukon got the. If I had the A2 with Yukon, I would have blasted them. So. I'm trying to think what I could have done better, but. Um, Yeah, I don't think I could have done anything better. Maybe kill Duchess and maybe would have like reviver. No, but the issue was Narciss anyway. The Narciss that blocked my skill. Okay, we got the first um, player that picks Narciss first. So let's see if we're gonna counter him with this stone skin build that I just did. So I'm gonna start with uh, actually Sifi. And then I'm gonna get um, um, Arima. Um, Arima, oh my god, what am I saying? Uh, Lady Mikage. I wish I had Arima. <laughs> so now, um, unless this Narces is at over 370 speed, I should go. Actually, he got the aura, so um, I need to put a champion that has speed aura. So maybe I'm gonna use Yukon or I'm gonna use Arbiter. Okay, use Yukon. And I don't know if it's gonna be a CC, a CC Yukon. I need to go first, absolutely first. If I go second, I'm dead. Because maybe this is a CC Yukon. So I'm gonna go with Arbiter and uh, And then I'm gonna get Quintus. So I'm gonna try with Quintus because um, if I can use the ally attack, Quintus is probably my best champion for ally attack. Let's see. But uh, I got a bad feeling. Uh, <laughs> Arima and Yukon and Armands together, they're so hard to deal with. And now I got two support champions too. Oh my god. So I'm forced to ban the warlord now. Wait, I don't know. Is it? Okay, let me get Armands. Yeah, because I can. Uh, there's no way I can use. Um, uh, Armands or Turvold. Okay, let's go with him. Sorry, nurse, uh, nurses. And now I'm thinking, I think I'm faster, but if he bends my Arbiter, he might be faster than me, especially with Warlord. Man, I hate to do this. Mm. Okay, let's see. I, I think, uh, I don't know. I honestly don't know. So I'm just gonna bend Warlord. Let's see who he bends. Okay, ban my Arbiter. So now, am I gonna be faster? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. And actually, I forgot, I should have picked Staltus. What the hell am I doing? Uh, accuracy or resistance? Let's go with the resistance. I should have picked Staltus. Instead of Narces. I completely forgot about Staltus. This is the first time facing a team like this. This team doesn't have any reviver, so if I can get a turn with someone. Okay, he's going first. Yeah, I mess up. I didn't pick Staltus, so it's just gonna deplete my turn meter. Yeah, and now it's probably gonna ship me, ship my uh, uh, Lady Mikage. All right, so the first one was a big, big, big fail, guys. Uh, 
So maybe maybe I don't have to pick Sifi. Maybe I need to pick Arbiter here instead of Sifi. And then I need to get someone else that has a, an, um, a speed lead. Like, you know, someone like maybe Yugo, maybe even, um, what's her name? Queen Ankora. Queen Ankora would have been good. But then I messed up because I didn't bring uh, Staltus in Stone Skin. So I can't do anything. I can't even sleep then because I got UDK. And now Arima is going to go again. That's it. This is lost. Okay, so big, big mistake. All right, let's see. Anyway, this is all about uh, for today is basically trying to counter him. We're going first, so we're going to pick him. Uh, recently use. Okay, I didn't use him still. So he's still at the back here somewhere. Here we go. Hmm. Do you guys have any tips for me? What do you guys think? So if I would have Staltus there in Stone Skin, he could have done something because he could have maybe stunned them. But because I didn't pick him, I messed up very bad. So he's going with Taras and Sifi. Um, I'm gonna go with the best counter for Taras, which are these two champions here. My only problem with the Nars is that it's very slow. It's up about 220 speed. And um, sometimes it doesn't even take a turn. It's very, very slow. But uh, unfortunately, that's the best speed I could have given right now. All right, so this guy got the uh, three support champions already. Hmm. Six star blessing karma. I think I'm going to bend the karma. Um, so I need to bring another nuker. And a support champions. I might go with um, Necrot here. And um, is it a Rotos or Yukong? Which one is better? I think I'm gonna go with Rotos because I'm scared he's gonna pick Rotos. Okay, let's go like this. Yeah, let's go with this, see what happens, see what he picks. Hopefully I can bend the Kaimar. But if he picks Arima, I need to bend Arima. Oh, well, actually no, I can keep, uh, I can keep Arima, but I don't know if he's going to bend my Narses. Hi, Res Ancora. Um, Narses. Uh, I don't have high resistance on um, Ankura, but you're right. High resistance is the way to go against um, Harmans. But you probably need like a champion with 700 resistance, right? That's the problem. 700 resistance. Uh, who am I going to ban here? Um, I think I'm going to ban Kamar. I can't afford to get slipped. And um, I got two magic champions, so maybe it's gonna weak it on me. Let's see. The lady, Lady Mika gets the real problem here because uh, he can do whatever he wants. She can stun me, um, ally attack. So, okay. I got the um, polymorph on uh, Rotos, but. Um, he didn't proc on Taras. Let's see what's happened now. Okay, put the weekend on me. And whose stone is that? Wait, what the hell is going on here? Is there like a relentless, um, <laughs> a relentless uh, on uh, Lady Mikage? It took two turns, right? Okay, oh my god, he called me, 
he shipped my um, narcissus anyway it's okay i need to get it done with that and clean my champion basically i don't think marotos can shot um okay beautiful he got me back but now i lost the block um i lost the block debuff so hopefully i can get it turned now and um I don't think I can kill this CF like that. She has too much HP. And I don't have increased attack. Uh, and Narcissus, I think, is, is gone next turn. He's, um, that is gonna kill him. So I'm gonna go like this. Maybe another thing that I should do also is build um, Necrity Stone Skin as well. Because now my. My neck can be uh, slipped, can be stunned, so I need to build the neck on his stone skin. Okay, let's see if he's... Yeah, my Narcissus is dead. Okay, no, he's still alive. I don't know why he didn't use the... He didn't use the A2. So I'm gonna kill him with the 1. And now he, he, he can't sleep Narcissus, right? Okay, perfect. So I can't block revive anybody. So I'm just gonna do this. Okay, GG. So lucky. Um, yeah, lucky I won that one. I don't know why I didn't use day two on uh, on Narcissus. Would have just killed him. Pretty sure about it. Anyway, better for me. Yeah, the thing is with uh, Ankora in her resistance, you need to be the high resistance, but she also needs to be fast. I mean, she has to be the first one to go so she can clean the team. Um, so, and also being a one turn stone skin at least. Okay, I got the chance to go Narcissus again. Narcissus is the way to go, guys. Especially if you don't have Yumeko and Warlord. Where's my drink? Oh, it's empty. Okay. And I still need to try Staltus. I think Staltus can do very, very really good against uh, Narcissus teams. So I have to 100% rem rem like remember to pick him next. But if I got a chance to pick uh, Armands, <laughs> I'm just gonna pick Armands. Okay, it's taking his time. He's thinking about it, maybe. It's not easy. I know. I know the feeling, like to go against him. Don't tell me this is a bot that. Um, Or maybe disconnect. I had a few fights where people just um, left the fight because I picked Narcissus. Um, Armands. Okay, no, he picked something. Yeah, but this one might be the computer picking for him because maybe he picked the highest um, power champions. So we got Krixia and um, Garol. So that's not good. Well, I think I need to use Narcissus for sure. And uh, I need Ankor, obviously. Like these two champions, if they're not together, they're not as good. So when they're together, they give the, the best. So it's very important that I pick them together. And uh, if he's gonna take another like 50 seconds, that means uh, he's not playing, he's just picking the champion. So this might be a very high uh, player that um, is running live arena um, with the uh, what's it called like uh, with the software so the computer is picking champion from him and I found out that when people use this software they can set up the champion to ban so they might say okay ban Armand's uh, first priority and then they can select uh, you know 
than Yukon's second priority. So it's not like, because usually when you fight against a bot, they ban the leader all the time. But I noticed that when you face these people, they ban whatever champion they want to ban because they set up the uh, software to do that. I spoke to someone of the Penta and told me that you can do this. It's crazy. So, uh, <laughs> is it going to be all the mythical champions? Maybe. I need to ban Crixia here. Oh, yes. This guy got them all. Mm. So, uh, I really hope he's, he's a bot that is not playing. Because if he knows what to ban, I'm, I'm screwed. Okay, I need to pick another DPS. So, but I also need to put um, protect my team. So maybe I'll go with uh, Rotos. Yeah, Rotos and well, Rotos. Hopefully, if he's if he's watching this, he's gonna pick uh, UDK. I'm screwed. Actually, let me go like this. Yeah, I'm gonna go like this because I, I know this guy can ignore, um, I think ignore the uh, ally protection maybe. And he can, he can ignore shield and stuff like that. So having Necker against him is um, pointless. So yeah, I need, I need the block damage, but who knows who's gonna pick now. Maybe Lady Mikake. If you pick the uh, champion Gala Galatir, you know the high health uh, mythical champion. That that champion, guys. I don't know if you're aware. He's probably is hands out the top three mythical champion. Okay, left. Wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. He could, should have done it at the start, though. He <laughs> made me waste like freaking four or five minutes for it okay oof perfect 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 and guys enjoy because i think um, after this uh, weekend uh, i think a lot of people pulled mythical champions so we're gonna see like more mythical champions in um, in labyrinth in general so it's gonna be more annoying I really hope you guys pull some mythical champions. I didn't. But uh, I'm gonna open some Primal Shard tomorrow. I'm gonna do a video, hopefully. Um, well, if I pull 33 rares, I'm not gonna do a video, obviously. But uh, if I pull something good, I might do a video. All right, so Arbiter and Sifi together. Um, yeah, I think I need to go with Armands. I'm I'm going second anyway, so Armands. But wait, what about if he goes with the bombs? He might go with the bombs. So okay, in case I'm gonna keep um, two cleansers, I'm gonna bring another cleanser here. Just um, is it he's going with Georgie or he's going with bombs? Okay, let's go with the uh, uh, block revive. Block revive. So this guy's gonna go 100%. He's gonna go with this three. I have to ban Warlord. And who's gonna be this one? I think it's gonna be. So I need to use him because he can protect me from the second hit of Folly and maybe has a. He's planning on using Yukong or uh, Rotos here. Um, but you know what? I think I'm gonna pick Rotos. Yes, Rotos probably my best friend right now. So I'm gonna pick him. He has to pick a Nuker. Finger cross is not Arima. Let's hope for no Arima. Hey, here we go, Arima. So, <laughs> all right. So Rotos is not gonna do much. Um. But Narses might do something. 
unless he ban my Narsis, but then he has to deal with um, this guy. So yeah, he ban Armands, beautiful. So we might get a turn here and we might do something. I have triple reaction on my uh, Narsis. So I got a 75% chance to stay alive. And my um, enemy has a 25% chance to one shot my Narsis. Let's see. Okay, good. Wait, I got an extra turn. Uh, I don't think I can kill him. But I'm gonna try anyway. 40,000. Oh my god, I mess up. <laughs> Actually, not really mess up because um, I can revive him and I can give him the skill back, right? With... Um, Ankara. So it's not a bad idea to do this, but it's not gonna have hundred percent turn meter. That's the problem. So you know what? I'm gonna keep him down. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do the booster meter. I didn't manage to go in front, but he can't do anything. He can't stun me because I got. Um, because I got Ankora, so I mean, provoke me. And now, what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna block revive him. And then I'm gonna nuke. Even though that's not gonna be enough because they, he, he doesn't have any shield or strength. And so, but at least now one is gone. That's what I want. And uh, I'm gonna try to get the fear. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. What ah, okay, uh, see if he cleaned the fear. Oh wow, big hit. Ooh, almost dead. Almost dead there. Okay, I'm gonna do this, revive him. Okay, skip a turn. Now, can I kill Sifi? I don't think so. But I need to try anyway. Let's see. Oh my god, almost. Okay, I think GG. <laughs> I failed. Yeah, I think the the fact that um, what's her name Rados died screwed me up so much. I still got another chance, I think, but um, I can't do much with day two. That's the problem. Let's see if I can reset the skill. If I can reset the skill, okay, I did reset the skill. Maybe I can block revive Arima. Nope. Arima's gonna destroy me now. Yeah, all right, GG. He couldn't be a bit, uh, unfortunately, I messed it up when I attack him. If I had uh, Rotos to give me a bit of a help, I could have win this one. Yeah, I still get countered very, very hard. That was uh, bad. I shouldn't I shouldn't be picking a blind Rotos like that. Okay, so I'm going first, guys. So, unfortunately, I can't showcase um, the Narcissus counter. <laughs> I'm... Tempting to just don't pick nurses, but then you know I'm gonna I'm gonna have a nightmare basically. So I can't be fast all the time. So maybe it's gonna be I'm gonna be second in the next one. So all right. So we go with these two. Um, I need UDK because I need to deal with. Um, with him and I'm gonna get Narses just because the reason why I'm picking Narses is because I don't want to face Narses. That's the main thing. But also he's an amazing nuker, so um yeah to get him is good. And um I know they are Rima and Yumeko. I need to ban Yumeko, I think. We will see because this team is very squishy and maybe I don't need to bend you, Mako, maybe. Um, it depends from what nuker he has. 
So I'm going to go with this one and Necret. Yeah, this time I'm going to go with um, Quintus instead of Rotos. And um, let's see who we pick next. If he doesn't pick a reviver, if this is uh, it's gonna be another like random champion, I'm just gonna ban Arima, and then it's gonna block my skill. But maybe I got a chance. Okay, pick the reviver, so I need to ban her. Especially uh, Elva, man, she's such a good champion. Like. She does so many things, especially with the veils. I'm surprised I don't see too many elvas in um, in uh, live arena. Uh, man, I feel like I'm gonna lose this one very, very quickly. Yep. Anyway, let me get the. I'm gonna put defense actually. I don't know because um, Narses can't do the double hit. I don't see any shield unless uh, he got bosters. Let's have a look. Does he have? Okay, he has bosters. That might cost him. But I also just realized that I forgot to pick uh, Ankura. So he can he can stun me and strip me. Okay, decide to kill my. Necret with day once. Okay, I think I got a reaction there. Is he gonna go with the OE? Let's see if he's uh, okay. He's a nuking one and he got down my necklace. So now I'm like, man, I can't believe he went two times. See, that's the problem when you have like nuker with like um, slow speed. Because I think I got like 230 on him and I got um, 210 on Narses. So he got the ship, he got the ship, he got the ship. Okay, I'm gonna do this, but um, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get a turn with Narses, unfortunately. I completely forgot to pick um, Ankura. Let me do this. This now he can't do much, but Arima is. Wow. That's a big hit. If he's, he's gonna sleep, oh my god, he got the stun again. Alright, so Arima won the fight for him, basically. I don't know if she got a refresh or he was actually a third turn, but um, yeah, fast uh, Lady Mikage. I need to boost the speed of my champion, basically. The nukers. I have some nukers at 250 speed. But um, one of them is Rotos, and I can't use him against Arima. And the second nuke that I have at 250 plus speed is Yukon, but I can't use him against Arima. So every time I face Arima, um, it's very, very hard for me. Okay, this guy didn't pick um, um, Armands. And uh, like I said, I need to pick him just because I don't want to face him. Because if I face him, it's, it's even worse than Taras to face him for me. So he decided to go with Warlord. So he, he rather have Warlord than um, Armands. And now he's going with Sifi and um, Taras. So he probably gonna get. He's probably gonna have a Marishka here as well. Marishka, and then he's gonna pick another Nuker. So I'm gonna keep the Nuker here because I wanna try and get uh, like you know Rodos or Yukong if I don't see Arima or UDK. So I'm gonna go like this, and um, 
actually gonna pick him as well because um, if he has a Marishka, I need this champion because otherwise the Tara is gonna counter on on me all the time. And also UDK is good against Sifi. Hmm. Crap. This is gonna be crazy hard. Okay, I need to go with... Um, yeah, I think I need to go with Rotos. It's my best option, especially because I got the Sister Blessing. Maybe I can ship Taras. Um, yeah, I don't know. But I think he can kill Rotos easily. He can do a double hit on Rotos. We will see. Actually, no, I can't double hit Rotos because um, I got UDK. So... I think Maroto is gonna maybe get a turn. I failed the ship, by the way. I haven't seen, I haven't like shipped Taras many times since I got the blessing. I don't even know if it's worth to have the polymer of blessing on him. It's only a 20% chance. Okay, let's see. This guy hits so hard, guys. It's, it's crazy. And also now he got the veil, so he can you can't even target him for like two turn. Well, now he's gonna lose the veil because he's on one turn. Let's see what skill he's gonna do. Hey man, just want to let you know I like the content you make. The YouTube video helped me a lot. Thank you, man. Thank you for the support. I might do more Adria video because now that I got the free removal gear. I might um, showcase Adra, um, especially hard mode, but I'm most likely going to do still uh, normal because I've already seen that my damage is not there with Tundra yet. Um, what I need to do here? Um, let's try to get rid of uh, this champion. Okay, so if I can do... Ooh, it proc... Um, Proc that. Let me try and get rid of her. I think I should be able to kill her. Yeah. But I wanted to uh, block reviver. But anyway, I already done this, so can't go back. Okay, still got the shield. That's good. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and proc uh, the the reset. Okay, I failed the reset of Rotos. You know what, maybe I should, I should have like used the shield because now it's going to want me. Yeah, damn. But anyway, I can still revive. Um, so if I killed, um, if I killed them now, they're just going to get revived by, yeah, it's not good. Let me try and do this. Let's see what happened. Okay, not enough damage. So I think um, he can't do. He can, he can only do this basically. He can only do the one. And I'm still gonna. I'm gonna revive Rotos actually now. So I'm gonna do this. Revive Rotos, right? Yeah. And Rotos should get a turn. He's not gonna die because he's gonna. If if he one one is gonna hit UDK, so he's still alive. Perfect. Oh, here we go. I talked too early. I talked too early. My God, I hate this termiter thing. So annoying, guys. I think it's because Taras with day one boost the termiter or something. So now I'm screwed, basically. Yeah, this guy's gonna kill everything. All right, basically, I should have tried and kill Sifu with the block revive. That's what I should have tried and do. I didn't do it, and now GG. I got my skill blocked. Can't do anything. 
My god, if only the Rotos would get a turn. It's crazy. Plus, I also have the mastery that when I kill an enemy, I get more speed. So I probably had like 260 speed there. So yeah, I'm gonna do more um, um, Hydra videos because um, I haven't done them since uh, I didn't have silver basically to change my gears. But now I'm gonna do it because uh, I wanna make that team better, the team with um, uh, Tundra and um, uh, the Emic. But also I'm gonna do more video like the one that I post earlier where I showcase how to build champion for Brutal. You know, you gotta try and get the accuracy right, the resistance right, and uh, basically you're trying to go in survival mode so you can get to a thousand turns, 1500 turns, and then you're gonna do big, big numbers. Regardless of the champion that you have, you know, you can have uh, Acrisia, or you can have Newt, or you can have uh, Ratalos. The fact that you're gonna do a thousand turns, you're gonna scale your damage by a lot. So. We got Vendetta. This guy must love uh, Narses. I mean Armands. He got him with the logo as well. I'm lucky enough to start first, man, all the time. So we got still another um, 50 minutes. So I'm probably gonna do another five fights. So this guy pick uh, Taras. So I need to pick uh, those two. And uh, let's see what he picks. I haven't, I haven't won many fights in this session. Um, I've been struggling. I've been very unlucky as well. Okay, so another Lady Mikage, another champion is gonna mess up things. Um, I need to bend the Yumeko and I need to deal with the Nuker. The question now is which nuker is gonna be. So I'm trying to think. I can strip her maybe, but I don't have uh, accuracy on my Yuko. So I think I'm gonna go with Yukon, and I'm gonna pick. Um, Should I pick Necret or you know what? I'm gonna go with Ellicott. Yeah, Ellicott because if he picks her, like I have to deal with Lady Mikage, and if I use um, the champion like Necret, that's just gonna get strip. There's no point. Maybe I can wash shot it with Ellicott. I need to change the build of my Ellicott as well. I need to build him in Savage with one turn stone skin. Okay, when we Quintus. So that's um, that's ugly. Because now I'm gonna cop a big uh, ally attack on my face. But I think it's okay. I mean, it depends um, from the reaction on Narses. So Narses might stay alive with the reaction, but Yugong is dead, but he's coming back by himself. So let's see what he does. I'll attack or trying to strip me. It's not really fast. His third meter is kind of like at the same level of mine. Okay, let's see. All right, so. Oh, wait. <laughs> the other attack doesn't work on Narses, I forgot. Because. Um, because yeah, that's not that turn basically. So now I'm gonna do this. At least I'm gonna survive one turn. Um, yeah, that's good. But Quintus can um, Quintus can do the A two and strip me. So let me try and do this. Let's see if I can kill something. Or right, I kill some. I wish I would have killed um, 
Lady Mikage. So this key does it give Termeter. Uh, feed the meter by yes okay let's hope we can get it a turn with Narciss see I don't understand how it's possible that I boosted the meter on my Narciss and Lady Mikage went before me I don't get it this is crazy okay what can I do now um, I can't do much to be honest so what I'm going to do, I'm going to kill her with this. I'm not going to block revive because uh, she didn't have three buff. And now I'm going to use day one and I'm going to try and reset the skill. So maybe I can reset the... No, I didn't reset anything. I was trying to reset the uh, revive. It's a 50-50 chance. So I think I'm going to just uh, put uh, Quintus down again, just like that. But now we gotta deal with Taras, and Taras has a big nuke with all those buff. Okay, I managed to survive. Now, let's read this skill. Revive Narsa with 100 turn meter, and then you're gonna decrease the turn meter of my enemies. And this effect can be, actually it's a 20%, so I wanna see now if I'm gonna get a turn with Narsus. Okay, finally I got a turn with Narsus. I thought I wasn't going to get a turn. Okay, I managed to win this one. It was kind of hard. Lucky my champion survived the Taras. Maybe his Taras is not super well built. But uh, for the moment, I got scared that I wasn't going to get a turn. <laughs> my God. Creed. I think I already faced this guy. Um, man, I... I really, I honestly don't want to be first. Why I keep getting first? This is crazy. I want to let them pick Narcissus, I mean Armands, but they're not picking. I mean, they, I went second a few times, but they've been picking like um, Sifis and Wardos and stuff like that. Uh, okay, so Marishka and uh, Sifi. That means uh, Taras is coming to join the party, right? So same opening, especially against um, Marishka, he's very strong because she pushed shield. Okay, now I went with the medical champion and Garo. So to counter him, I need to use UDK because uh, he can prevent the single target hit that then does the splash damage. So he's my only way of surviving that. And then um, he has to pick another support. So... It can be well it can be it can't pick Arima unless he wants to pick Arima. So I might go with uh uh Rotos here or Yukong Yukong Rotos mm. good question let's go with Yukong why not yeah let's try like this Okay, interesting decision. Went with Necret. Um, hmm. Who should I ban? Should I ban the Sifi or the Marishka? I think I need to ban, yes, yeah, Sifi. He can go ally attack, but the ally attack is fine because, like I say, he can't do anything to Narciss and uh, Yukon can just come back to life. So, at least now, if I kill Marishka. There is only one reviver and it's this guy, but it has to be the last one. So I'm going to make sure that he's not the last one because <laughs> he can revive when he jumps to the other form. Let's see. Okay, go Bolster. That's good. It's good for me. More Bolster, more Strength. But we don't care about those ones because um, we can ignore those ones with... Uh, uh neck i mean with narcissus i'm trying to think if i can shot something here i don't think i can so i'm just gonna do a one wait oh my god i misclick i use the you know what actually good i got the block buff and now um 
So do they have, I don't think they got debuff, right? No, they don't have debuff. So I can actually do this and protect my team. Okay, now I'm gonna use this skill. Hopefully I can kill them. I'm gonna do double hit everybody, every, everywhere, sorry. And one thing uh, about this champion, uh, if I attack with Narses, uh, the mythical champion there, he's not gonna proc his block damage thing because I'm I'm gonna ignore this, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to one shot him. Okay, I did one shot him. So that's good. And um, yeah, that's something that uh, people maybe don't know about it, is that um, Narses basically counter his passive. And that's good now that she got the, the, all this buff because now I'm gonna try and, and I'm gonna try and um, block revive him. Uh, I'm just gonna do. Wait, who has the ship here? Yeah, he has the ship, so I don't wanna risk it. I'm just gonna do this, and I'm just gonna do a one, and now I'm gonna try and block revive her. Okay, but now he's gonna come back alive, and now I gotta be careful because if I kill him now, he's gonna get the block damage. So I need to kill him next turn. Okay, she's dead. He can't do anything. He can he's gonna he's gonna hit um, UDK. And uh yep, yeah, that's it. GG. Don't kill I don't have to kill anything, I just have to wait. Because like I say, I don't wanna get the passive, otherwise it's gonna revive everybody, and like this, I'm gonna kill them both. Okay, that was um, easier than expected. Okay, let's do another five and um, let's hope we go second time. We're gonna go second so we can um, let other people pick Narcissus. And then I actually wanna check how many fights I won because I'm not sure. Mr. Blonde. Okay, I'm going second. Pick, pick Armands, please. Yes. Okay, let's do this. Okay, now. Um, so before I went with Lady Mikage, I mean, yeah, Lady Mikage and Sifi, but then they banned my Arbiter. I didn't go first. So should I go with um, Arbiter first? But then if you pick Sifi, it might be faster than me anyway. So no, I need to go like this. And then I also need the uh, increased defense for style too, so. Okay, so let's see. Let's hopefully it doesn't have a Rima. Okay, hmm. Narciss and um, Queen Ankora. So lucky these two champions are magic affinity. So we can use Taltus. But wait, let me um You know what I'm gonna get Duchess here. Yeah, Duchess is a, because also if I pick Staltus, I need to make sure that he doesn't pick um, Duchess. Or maybe I keep Staltus for last one. Duchess um And also, it might be Kratos too. You know what? I'm gonna go like this. I think it might be Kratos. Let's see. I can obviously ban Narsa, so I don't have to worry about it. If he doesn't place any lockouts. Okay, he didn't place any lockouts. So I'm gonna keep uh, him. And um, trying to think, she can cleanse. I think I need to. I need to get rid of her or him. Uh, let me go with uh, Rotos. Yep. So Rotos is, and I'm gonna ban uh, this champion. And now let's see if this uh, champion that I build in Stone Skin, they're gonna be. Because I can ban him and have a chance, but then I, I'm not gonna do the showcase, so I'm gonna ban him. 
any Ben Marotos I'm gonna put him in the lead well do uh, am I gonna have enough damage now <laughs> I just realized because you Ben Marotos obviously well I'm I'm strong I'm strong affinity against the hair so I can kill her eventually so I got, I got the I got the sleep I mean the um, fear let me see if I can okay lucky I managed to get a turn and now what should I do now let me try and strip them I guess So this one plays the stun and this is just land um, let's see if I can land the weaken no I didn't strip them so they resist the 50-50 chance okay they buff themselves so Lady Migag is just is dead wait it doesn't have buff though so maybe it's not it wasn't gonna be able to one shot my team okay shields hmm this is gonna be so hard now and this guy's gonna get a turn so wait what does I got the uh, block debuff from the masteries okay um Yeah, I think I'm gonna put um, increased defense on me, just like that. And unfortunately, it got there. It got there. So I'm just gonna try and sleep Taras. Okay, I didn't sleep him for some reason. I think he's not a hundred percent chance, maybe. Okay, strip everybody. All right, so hopefully Staltus can get it too, but I don't think so. Look at these um, champions. Yeah, booster meter. It's gonna shift somebody. I'm oh, sorry, no, it's gonna stun somebody. Yeah, you got wicked on um, on air, double wicked. Lucky for me. So now maybe I can stun him. And what is going on with this um, resistance man? All right, I think a three percent cost me the game because I didn't place the stun on him. Oh well, what can I do? Three percent is a three percent. <laughs> so I don't know what I could have done better. The problem was that um, I didn't I didn't strip the stun skin at the start on uh, Ankura and Marishka, so that was big. And also my Staltus, I don't think he's gonna have enough power to take down those two champions like in a few turns. It's gonna take me a long time. So it has to be also like someone that doesn't use these two and not and Harmas at the same time. So yeah, there is a lot of things that need to be uh, considered. The only thing would be maybe to bring three nukers, but then with three nukers you're so squishy as a whole team so in all those fights that I've done so far I never use uh, armands they always ban my armands because it's not here on the champion that I used recently so now so far this um, counter of armands is not working and now I need to deal with this um, six star Yukong. So I need to get 100% um, need to get him for block revive and uh, him for um, um, avoiding the A2 of uh, Yukong.
Okay, go Raman to and um, uh, what's his name? Lazarus. So Ramantu is going to be very annoying. So he might be the, the champion that I'm going to ban if I can. Um, who should I pick now then? Well, I need I need the stripper, so I need her. So maybe I can clean the debuff here and uh, nuker. Who should I pick as a nuker? Well, I need to I need to go with the uh, rotos. It's not it's no the option. Cause Quintus is gonna die. He's single target. Yeah, maybe Staltus I could use, but. I'm gonna have a tough time against a Sifi to kill Sifi with Staltus. Okay, went with Emic. So I guess it's gonna be a two turn stone skin Emic. So it's gonna bend my um, Armands. And. Um, well, this is gonna be bloody hard. I need to remove him because otherwise, if he block my passive, I'm screwed. But I need to wait for the unkillable to fall before I can start doing something. So I don't know. Well, yeah, because I can ignore the unkillable with Rotos, but um, I need to attack um, Emic first. Yeah, two turn Emic. Obviously, it's a fast Emic, so this Stonsky is not going to stay there forever. Okay, strip me. He didn't go shipped. No ship, unfortunately. Let's see what he's gonna do. Okay, I think he got wiki on Rotos and he got the reaction on him. I'm just gonna do. Actually, gonna use the one. I wanna get rid of the. Uh, well. I don't need to get rid of the block buff anyway, but I'm gonna use this one. Okay, it didn't it didn't stand my my um my my cooldowns. And now I need to yeah I need to clean. Okay, perfect. And here what should I do is Yeah, I'm, go I'm gonna do this so I can take everybody at low HP. I guess it's a good thing to do. And um, yeah, now the, the, the stone skin is gone. So hopefully I don't die. If somebody die, I'm gonna get my skill reset. Yeah, wait. Wait, it didn't it didn't go into the other form? Okay, it didn't it, it didn't try and kill me for some reason. Maybe he knew that he couldn't kill Rodos and he was scared for me to get the extra turn. So I'm gonna do this. Oh, I need to target him. He still has the taunt that he's gonna lose now. Perfect. Wait, 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 give me a turn. Wait, 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 wait. So let me kill her. And let me get rid of him. Okay, now you can go. Wait, this guy also revive. I just realized. These bastard champions. A nuker that can revive. So. So he just revived Sifi. Um, let me see if I can. Um, I can block revive him. What is he gonna do? Okay, just the. Oh my god, he extend this my skill. Okay, so I can't do much. I'm just gonna do a one here. And he has the veil still. So I can't target him. I think he gets the veil every turn, maybe. So now I'm gonna try and do this. Hopefully, I can kill him. Damn. So close. This is looking very bad, guys. 
now I know why it didn't transform. He kept this form so he could um, um, revive Sifi. Okay, I reset the cooldowns. Uh, I don't know. I, I might do this just to try and keep him alive, but um, I don't think I can. So, yeah, I think he's gonna kill me now and then he's gonna reset my skill, so it's pretty much GG. Yep, nothing I can do. I actually did well. He kept that form. He kept the veil on. I couldn't kill him. And um, yeah, my nurses had the skill increase because of his passive. So I got a lucky there and um, yeah, I can't do anything. Let me check uh, what's emic um, percentage on the passive. It's a 50-50 chance, so it's more. So when attack on the shield has a 50, so it's a 75% chance, so yeah, it's good enough. So how many how many I lost today? So I lost some, the majority of my fights. So I'm still gonna do three more fights. We still got 23 minutes. So, so far the Arman's counters is didn't turn out to be any good. Um, you still need to deal with the other uh, three champions around the uh, Armands. And um, let's see if he's gonna. Okay, I'm going first, so I'm gonna pick Armands. Mythical champions are still uh, broken, broken strong. Um, yes, Labyrinth is a mess. I really hope I can pull my first mythical champion tomorrow. And hopefully it's not gonna be a Lady Mikage because <laughs> imagine that. I actually believe it's gonna be Lady Mikage, guys. My first mythical champion, like as in like pull from shards, because I fuse her. It's gonna be funny if it does be Lady Mikage. Oh my god, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, yeah, I don't know to be honest. Is it I got Lady Mikage or I'm gonna pull the the what's it called um, the Dark Elf one, the Scarab guy. If I pull him, oof, I don't know. I got nightmares just to think about if I'm gonna pull the worst uh, mythical champions tomorrow. If I do pull a mythical champion. Okay, so I have to deal with Lady Mikage again. He went with the Rotos already, so I'm gonna pick him for sure. And he has to pick another Nuker. It might be Arima here. So, um, Ale Attack. I need to pick a champion that is not gonna die from Ale Attack. So I think he has to be Yukong, right? I mean, he's gonna die, but he's gonna come back alive. Let's see who he picks. Hopefully not, Rima. Please spare me. I don't know. If he had Arima, I probably would have picked him before Roto. So, no, I don't think he has Arima. Okay, my last... My last words, I say he doesn't have Arima, now he's gonna show me Arima. Okay, Santa, that's uh, interesting. That's, maybe he wanted to pick Yukong, but I picked him. Because uh, honestly, Santa, i never seen anyone use him in, <laughs> in Live Arena. <laughs> but he actually can be annoying because he plays the unkillable, right? Okay, didn't ban uh, Armand's finally, so I can use him. Uh, I'm probably gonna go after him. But I might go before the Nukas with Armand's, hopefully. Let's see. Yeah, see, I'm gonna go... If he doesn't... Uh, no, he, he can't strip you, but he can't stun me anyway in the same skill. Unless he has a Relentless one, like the other guy did. 
Okay, now nothing happened, luckily. So, so now if I do this, I'm gonna drop the termite. Okay, it's a high resistance. Um, but that's that's interesting. I think it's a high resistance. Um, what's his name? Um, Mr. Santa Claus. I forgot his name. Ah, Sir Nicholas. So let's see if it's just a three percent or is actually legit high resistance. No, it's high resistance. That's that's very good because now it's gonna put the unkillable. Beautiful. Okay, I like this. Um, I like this counter. Very interesting. So what I'm gonna do now is uh, I'm gonna smack them. Okay. Okay. I strip Sifi. Beautiful. And uh, let's see if I can reset any skill. I didn't reset anything. Wow, okay, I got uh, I got the slip because now Anchor is protecting um, Yukon. Okay, now I can stun me. Wait, it didn't stun me. Wow, okay. I'm gonna do a one here. I increase uh, um, the cooldown. Okay. Rotos is back and that's not good because um, he might get a turn if I try to nuke. Let me try and get the uh, this Okay, beautiful. I don't know if I want to nuke because if I nuke, I'm gonna wake him up and then he's gonna just kill my champions. So I'm just gonna do a one here. Hopefully, I can kill it with a one. Perfect. And I'm gonna do this first. Yeah, we gotta be careful to um to rotos right the passive if he gets a turn then my team was very squishy i wouldn't be dead but i like this this is good sir nicholas i mean any champion with um high resistance is the way to go basically so i don't build in my champion stone skin one to stone skin would be enough but you need to be some champion with at least 750 resistance at least um and even if 750 resistance if you have 650 you're still gonna struggle because uh it still has like a 70 percent chance or maybe 65 65 percent chance to um do his um skill you know the ship the the uh depleter meter okay didn't pick um Arma, so I'm gonna pick him. And now against Arima, who should I go with? I feel like I need to pick uh, Sifi because Sifi is gonna be so annoying. If he picks Sifi, otherwise, usually I don't pick Sifi. I got no room for her, but I wanna get rid of the increased defense on um, Arima. So at least Arima is not gonna go full damage from the start now let's see what he has maybe some mythical champion he has a lot of points so okay went with uh udk and um udk and uh, warlord so he has to pick a nuker and a support hmm Okay, I think I have to pick Narses and uh, Queen Ankara. And my last nuker is gonna be based on what he picks. I got a feeling though that he's gonna pick Rotos. But I can't pick Rotos. I can't. I just can't. Because I got two champions that really counter Rotos. So if he counter if he pick Rotos. I don't even know how I'm gonna win to be honest. Okay, let's let's pick those one. Maybe I could have picked Duchess here instead of uh, Ankura, and maybe I could have like survived a turn against um, Rotos. Now here he picked Duchess. Man, I think this one I, I lost this one on the draft. Cause now. I can't do anything. 
I can't pick him because he's going to do no damage. Look, I'm going to pick... Uh, yeah, I'm going to pick two of us and see what happens. Yeah, it was either Tulva or Xena. Maybe Xena would have been decent here, but still not like a a way to win. I, I have to see how fast is this um is this um touches. So he didn't ban uh, Armands because he probably thought that um now that I, I don't have Narses, I'm not going to have enough damage. And it's probably true, to be honest. Um, let's see. I feel like uh, the drought went wrong because I picked um, pick Sifi. But he was going to pick Sifi anyway. So I'm going to boost... I'm gonna do this. Let's see. Wow, well, I got the weak hit on the um, on air. So maybe I got a chance if uh, she's uh, she's not in a full resistant build. Let's hope. What what blessing she has? That's okay. She's a five star, so she has a lot of resistance. I think. Yeah. A lot of resistance and uh, but now at least I strip him so that's good I need to uh, yeah I need to do this oh wait not really well I'm gonna do it trying to get the termiter he has a five star blessing on the on the polymorph Damn, I was hoping to go before her. You know what? It's actually good. Hopefully, Duchess go before. Wait, 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 wait. My God. If Duchess would have gone, I would have killed Duchess the turn after that. So he stunned. Um, so I better don't do anything to Rotos. Let's kill the. Oh, wait. I need to get an Estador. Oh my god, I messed up. I didn't I didn't put the increase attack. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's see what happened. At least the road will still stand. But I should have killed that Ima there. Yeah, here we go. GG. I wonder how much uh, accuracy he had he had. To be honest, because I think I got 400 resistance on my on my champion. Okay, that's like that. Yeah, I messed up. I should have put increased attack, and I would have killed them both with uh with in one go. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, luckily that happened. So now I need to kill. Uh, Rotos because if I don't kill Rotos, I'm dead. But now he's gonna revive everybody with the uh, veil. Okay, so I did that because I want him to get revived from Ankora. So let's see if I can do this. Okay, perfect. Now I got a at least I got a chance now. And uh, I'm gonna try and strip them again. At least the other ones, perfect. So the 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 veil is gone. Um, I don't know if I can kill her with uh, because I'm gonna hit him as well, and she's gonna come back. So I'm gonna I'm gonna kill him. Okay, I don't wanna risk her. Okay. And now I'm gonna boost. I feel I'm in a good spot, but um, it's still um, it's still not. I don't know if I want to be honest. Let's see if I can reset someone's skill. Can okay, reset this skill? That's good. So maybe I can stun them again. 
Okay, perfect. I managed to get another turn. Let's do this. And I need to kill her with two volt. Let's hopefully do it. Okay, perfect. So my turbo is not in Savage, but I still hit like a truck. And uh, what blessing they have? Okay, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I'm just gonna do hit this on him. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna wait for Arima to come back. And then I'm gonna blast her. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of Rotos. So like this. Yeah, let's do this. Let's bring it back his turn meter again. Okay, GG. Okay, perfect. It went pretty well. I think I got lucky. What champion did I ban? Was it you make right? Yeah. So yeah, I guess I got lucky because um I polymorph uh, Arima, that's why. But if I wouldn't mess up that increased attack from Toolvolt, I would have killed Arima and UDK at the start and maybe um, it would have been a completely different fight. So yeah, I got lucky, but I lucky as well. So GG, it was a good, it was a good fight. All right, let's go. We got eight minutes and I think this is my last key. Is it my last one or my second last one? And then I'm gonna be done with this uh, live, guys. Thank you for stepping by. If you guys got any question, let me know. Uh, leave a comment to this uh, live, and I'm gonna, like I always do, go back and check the comments and stuff. Uh, trying to reply to everybody all the time. And uh, so, Kaimar is. Um, I, I need to use these two because at least they're not gonna get sleep. I need to use them. And um, and guys, next um, what I'm gonna do is these days because I can change my gears. I'm gonna do the Tundra showcase on uh, normal on Hydra. I'm gonna push the Sion Sintranos. I'm still stuck at stage six, so I need to push uh, Soul Cross. So I'm gonna do that. Uh, what's going on here? I'm gonna use the Mythical Champion. So I need to use UDK. And we're gonna ban Warlord, and um, he can't place any more uh, support. And I got UDK anyway, so it's either I go with Yukon on him, Yukon or Rotos. Um, I don't know, Yukon or Rotos. Let's go with Yukon. I'm not sure because um, if he has Arima. You know what, well, let's go like this. Um, so what I was gonna say, so I'm gonna do the video on Hydra, normal with Tundra, and then Sirius Intranos pushing Soul Cross, and then I'm gonna have um, a video about the Ice Golem. Um, I wanna talk about a team that I've seen, and uh, I also wanna do a, a video about Fire Knight. Uh, I'm trying to do a video with um, a team without uh, nut it's gonna be very hard but i'm gonna try and also has to be a team that um, does it in fast time because uh, there are team out there that don't use nut but they're like five six seven minutes long and that's not my point So if I can make a team is about two or three minutes, uh, probably two minutes and a half, three minutes without not, um, I'm gonna make a video about that. So I have to do many, many videos this weekend. Okay, I guess uh, what's, what happened? So he banned my Narciss and he got my, okay, what happened there? Ah, he sleep. So he got my stone skin and he slipped me. Can you believe this? Okay, got a wicked. Now I need to try and revive him and hopefully I can get a boost. So he's gonna arrive with 50%. Let's see. He doesn't have any more AoE, I think, though. 
So I don't, I don't, oh well, he reset this, he set his kill, so he's gonna one shot me again. Yeah, alright, so. What can I say, guys? Karma, they strip uh, everything, slip everything. Um, I couldn't do anything else anyway. It's either a Ben Karma or Warlord, so. Unlucky there. Okay, look. Um, I lost three here. I lost three here. I think I won maybe six fights out of 15. So it was a terrible session. But. Um, yeah, uh, it's, it's hard, guys. It's um, I'm um, I'm in um, goal four. I'm in goal four, right? Or goal three? I forgot where I am. So I'm in goal three, four thousand hundred points, and there is a lot of mythical champions. And unfortunately, I can't counter those because I, I got any except for Lady Mikage. But like I said, I'm gonna open up some um, uh, this um. Primals uh, probably tomorrow, so hopefully I can get my first Miko champion because I think I opened almost 90 of those so far and I got nothing except one legendary champion that wasn't even good. So thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna close the live right now and uh, I'm gonna see you soon with uh, one of those videos that I'm gonna publish in one of those days. Stay safe and uh, take care.